Chances are you have not been spending a lot of time in the sun these past few months. But while the weather's still cool, the winter is a great time to check your skin for any suspicious spots. The American Cancer Society reports that annually 2 million cases of basal and squamous cell cancers are diagnosed, resulting in over 3,000 deaths and over 68,000 cases of melanoma are diagnosed with 8,700 deaths. Dr. Dino Madonna of Lake Ear, Nose, Throat and Facial Plastic Surgery explains what you should look for when checking your skin and the different types of skin cancers. The three biggies, so to speak, are basal cell, squamous cell and melanoma. And uh, statistically, I'd say basal cell probably is about 70% of all skin cancers, squamous cell about 20%, melanoma, 5% and then a hodgepodge of oddball varieties, rare, rarities, the other five, remaining 5%. Melanoma um, is, is, the, is the biggie in the fact that it uh, is the most dangerous. So luckily it's not the most prevalent. It can spread throughout the body and it can kill you. Number one cause, obviously, is sun exposure. Your top layer of skin, called the epidermis, is made up of squamous cells and uh, basaloid cells, hence the name basal cell carcinoma, uh, squamous cell, and then melan melanocytes, which provide the pigment to the skin. Statistically, um, there's definitely been an increase over the past 20, 30 years in the incidence of skin cancer. Um, most likely that's due to just the you know, damage to the ozone that's been done over the years. Uh, as well as some of the uh, practices that were encouraged uh, earlier in years, such as, you know, it was, it was considered healthy to go out and bake in the sun and to slather on baby oil and put the iodine on and, you know, sunblock, what is that? In my opinion, the areas that are sun exposed, your face, your forearms, you know, the higher SPF, the better. As far as melanomas go, there's a nice little acronym, it's just ABCD, A meaning asymmetry so that the size of the actual lesion itself is not um, symmetrical. Portions are kind of irregular, uh, whether either in color um, or in pattern. Uh, B um, stands for irregular borders. C are for speckles or colors, uh, changes in colors, and D for diameter. You're going into a tanning bed, 210. I mean, it's UV radiation just the same. Um, it, it's actually worse because you let your guard down. You're not wearing your sunblock. I mean, you're, you're basically uh, inviting the ultraviolet radiation. They're just bad. For more information on this story, as well as links to the specialist at Lake Ear, Nose, Throat, and Facial Plastic Surgery, please click on the Precancerous Cells story link on our homepage, yourhometownhealth.com.